Yo, what's up guys, Tom for 2 here, and this is a sit-down commentary, the first one I have done in a really, really, really long time, so I'm probably a little bit rusty doing these, but anyways, what's going on? It's been, uh, it's been, a, it's been a while, um, and uh, just to showcase a little bit of Black Ops Cold War beta gameplay, uh, I think this is just some hard point, uh, me just stomping with the M16, and a bunch of attachments I don't even know or remember anymore, but uh, M16 is pretty good in Cold War uh, once that drops, so hopefully uh, if you guys still watch for the COD content, um, definitely give the M16 a try in some of these uh, bigger maps. Um, but yeah, today we're just going to be, I guess this is kind of a welcome back sit down commentary, kind of what's up, what's been going on. Um, as if you guys have been watching my channel for the past, you know, year or so, uh, we've been grinding Warzone with the GOG clan, um, with Sumzu, Gucci Boy, and Jimmy John Jumbo, aka Type W, if you guys watched my previous videos back in the past. So, uh, yeah, we've, we've surpassed 100 plus wins in Warzone, um, and now that Cold War is about to come out, uh, I guess we're getting ready for the changes that are going to be coming to... Uh, I guess the new Battle Royale mode that's gonna come out, uh, with the new guns and everything, so I don't even know if they're changing the map, but that's only, uh, that's the only Call of Duty they we really play. We just, uh, played a little bit of the Cold War beta together, and, um, you know, we haven't actually played COD together since, like, Black Ops 2, and then we all kind of went our separate ways, and then as soon as Warzone came out, we all kind of came back together and said, hey, let's just get on, so... Uh, that's pretty neat. Uh, Sumzu is obviously not posting anymore on his channel, but still has more subs than me. So if any of you guys still came from Sumzu's channel, be sure to sub here if you want to hear his beautiful voice. Um, yeah, and Gucci Boy, uh, aka uh, Big China, you know, uh, little squeaker before, but uh, now a beast at Call of Duty after uh, training in the CS:GO uh, training facility. So. Uh, yeah, now I'm the one who's pretty trash, along with, uh, you know, Jimmy John Jumbo is usually carrying, carrying, doing his fair share of carrying, so, um, we're back at it, but, uh, don't play a whole lot now that, you know, I'm, I'm kind of switched over to playing a lot of, uh, Teamfight Tactics or TFT on the League Client. Um, TFT is, if you guys didn't know, is a auto chess game, um, I am ranked master, so that's like right below grandmaster and challenger. So uh, I'll probably grind for uh, at least grandmaster in the current set. Um, but I know that's not Call of Duty based. So, anyways, uh, I have no idea what else to talk about. I'm just gonna be rambling, I guess, for the next four minutes, or uh, you guys can just watch this um, nice gameplay. I mean. Um, how I feel about Cold War, I guess we'll just talk about Cold War in general, uh, with the beta and everything, but, um, honestly, the movement is complete trash. <laughs> um, if I were to rate the game based on the beta, I'd probably have to give it, like, a 5 out of 10. Probably will not buy. Um, honestly, the, the game doesn't even feel that much like Call of Duty anymore, at least from when we last played, uh, multiplayer. Um, just, just the movement and everything, it's just a little off, and it's killstreaks, let's talk about killstreaks. You literally only call in like two UAVs a game, which is honestly kind of kind of disappointing, it was better when you could just get three kills, easily pop a UAV, get four kills, pop a counter UAV, and then now you have to wait your turn to call in like attack helicopters, uh, and like you could, you could fill up the little bar for how many uh, points it takes to get the killstreak, but then you'll never actually uh, be able to call it in sometimes until like the very last minute of the game when the game is pretty much over so going for 100 pluses and stuff is going to be like really really tough in this game unless you're absolutely just the only one stomping because if someone else is also um stomping the lobby then you're going to be fighting over um calling in kill streaks to up your scores right so uh, that's a big complaint uh, weapons, I mean, you you put 10 attachments on a single, single gun. I think this M16 I'm using has like 10 attachments on it, and it's, um, it's kind of ridiculous how many, how much, uh, power you could, additional power you could put onto your weapons, right? Uh, to increase the accuracy, reduce the recoil, so I assume that, you know, some of the guns later, weapons are gonna be, um, gonna have to be tuned based on 
people just slapping on all the attachments that they can, right? Um, uh, so, I mean, I tried out the M16, the Baby AK. Baby AK is probably my favorite sub. MP5 is not bad either. Um, and the ARs, I noticed the ARs are just not as good. Um, I tried the, what's it, the M4. Uh, and of course the M16 is, a, is considered a, sh a sharpshooter marksman rifle or something, so. Um, honestly didn't have a whole lot of issue, at least with ARs in this map, but in some of the other maps like Moscow and, um, uh, what's it, the nighttime map, it's just, just, just really bad. Uh, you might as well just run SMGs. Uh, another complaint I have, uh, visibility. I, I know that I actually can't see crap when I aim down sights, or just like some of the maps, it's just the brightness or the, just the visibility is just complete ass. Um, and honestly, yeah, as I as I'm getting older from Black Ops 2, I just I just can't see my vision. Just you just can't see sometimes. And you second guess, and you just even though you might get the first shots, I'm second guessing half the time when I'm aim down sights, unless I'm pit firing right next to the person. So um, I hope they change something uh, with the visibility. Um, a Modern Warfare uh, Warzone, the visibility is complete garbage in that too. That's one thing I have to say about Warzone. It's I kind of revive Call of Duty a bit, but you know I still can't really see crap. I'm, I'm second guessing half the time, and I'm seeing things uh, based on the lighting. So hopefully we'll see. They probably won't fix that based on you know what I'm kind of hearing. They're not going to change a whole lot from the based on the beta and everything. But um, yeah, I probably won't be buying the game. Um, probably just stick to Warzone, the free to play stuff. I mean we're just free to play players now. Um, uh, so, that's kind of the rundown on Modern Warfare. I, I mean, I have a couple more gameplays, live commentaries, and I'll probably come out with another sit-down commentary, maybe, just to ramble about some stuff, but, uh, it's been, it's been fun. Um, now that, uh, we have a little bit more time, uh, I've, I've gotten, gotten to, around to posting a little bit more, you know, a daily uploader now, based on how many Warzone wins we have, for crying out loud. Carried by Gucci Boy and Sumzu, of course, and, Occasionally type PW when he uh, decides to uh, you know, turn turn it turn it on. So uh, be sure to sub uh, if you want more content like uh, Call of Duty. Uh, I'll definitely be posting more Warzone even when Cold War comes out. And uh, sub if you want to see um, some TFT stuff too, because uh, you know TFT is kind of where I'm kind of leading the competitive competitive. Um, you know, scene is kind of picking up speed, and I'm seeing if I could uh, grind up the ladder, see if I'm actually getting good. So, um, I've come out with a couple guides, some gameplays, but, you know, the bread and butter is still going to be Call of Duty. This is what always was a Call of Duty based channel. Um, but honestly, just be posting whatever the heck I feel like. So, uh, thanks for listening, guys. Uh, thanks for sticking around. I know we're at uh, like 58 subs, so if we could get to like 60 subs, um, that would be awesome. So, be sure to share with your friends and. I tell him to check him, check out an old guy who still plays uh, Call of Duty and uh, some TFT with the boomer reaction speed. So, uh, yeah, thanks again for listening, and be sure to drop a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.